yo welcome back to the channel everybody today is thursday october 6th and y'all see me earlier i was in target i had to run in and get a few essentials i did not go overboard today i did not get anything that i did not need i'm proud of myself so let's go through a quick haul because today i am about to be tidying up our room um my shelves need to be dusted very badly. The bathroom needs a small upgrade. Um, I have the organizer that you hang like on the hook of the shower head. Hate it. It always slips down. And I'm thinking it's going to like be final destination moment. So they got to go today. Um, and I am going to get my nails done today. It's been a long time coming. Y'all. It's been a long time coming. Um, after I get my nails done... I may or may not dye my hair today. I'm undecided, but I am going for the ginger look. I'm starting to get rough around the edges. My, um, I got my hair retwisted a couple weeks ago, and it's gone now. So it's time to do something to my hair. So before I get into like the cleaning portion. Uh, dusting off like the bookshelves and stuff. I'm going to show y'all a quick haul. I went to Walmart yesterday. Um, and I don't think I showed y'all anything that I got from there yesterday because I had left everything in the truck because I told her they're working on our freaking paving our new, uh, like new, make a new pavement or whatever. And I was not going to carry all this stuff in the house. So I left the stuff that I did not need in the truck. So quick Walmart haul. I got these cute little acorn um cups i love getting stuff like this um they're like the they say acorn uh sipper so that's what it is of course y'all see so got the straw and stuff i love getting little festive things for alan and egg to drink out of and i'm gonna do this until they grow out of it okay if they don't like it no more than hey understand but i got these for thanksgiving dinner um we cook Thanksgiving dinner at the house and we do Christmas breakfast. So on Christmas day, we get to move around. So I just got them something cute to, you know, keep the drink out of whatever. And I found disco balls in Wally World. And I got all the ones that were hanging up. Of course, these are ornaments, but I love seeing people use disco balls as the core. Um, so I got those. Those were kind of a necessity for me. Not really, but yeah. I got added Alan this shirt from the uh, Free Assembly collection. I absolutely love Free Assembly. And I really think that they're trying to do like the Free People Duke, the kid version. No matter what, I'm obsessed. So I ended up getting that shirt for him. Um, I get all of Alan pants from this collection. The Athletic Works collection from Walmart. He is a big joggers person. Alan ain't into jeans. He don't like nothing that's going to rub him because he gets very irritated easily. So I got him some cute like little joggers. I don't know what kind of material this is, but they have like a little leg like that. And I got him a pair of blue ones. They have some olive green. They have black. They have gray. Um, they have navy. And it's another color. It's another color they have too. So they have several colors. So I just started out with a couple pair and I'm gonna go back and buy a couple more pair. Um also <laughs> I got me a Christmas moo. I'm so excited. Cause this moo, these colors are my Christmas decor colors this year. Had to grab it, could not leave it there. I don't know why, but I'm into graphics lately, like heavy graphics. I cleaned out like my t-shirt t-shirt drawer last night and I really threw away like all I threw away a lot of tees last night. I don't know why, but I'm just obsessed. The graphic tees are it for me. And this rolling stone one. All the vibes, y'all. Love it, love it. We're supposed to go to Nashville for our anniversary slash honeymoon. We didn't get to go on a honeymoon because 2020, the year everything shut the heck down. And that's when we decided to get married. Uh but I'm thinking my ripped shorts, jean shorts, my white cowboy boots, and my white cowgirl hat. My cowgirl boots and cowgirl hat. Mm. 
It's going to be a vibe. So that's all that I got from Wally World. Now, from Target this morning, Addie got these pajamas. I thought they were cute. And this week, well, now until Saturday, Target has like um, an extra 20% off of kids' pajamas. So I made sure that I got those for her. We need some mini trash bags to go like in our trash can in the bathroom and Allen's and Addie's trash can. And also I got her some little training pants. She's been sleeping in underwear for the last couple nights. Well, training underwear, so they're really thick, like in the seat area, just in case she does pee, and she hasn't peed on herself. So, happy about that, but we try to put pull-ups on her when we're, like, out in public. Like, if we're, like, at the fair, for example, when we were at the fair, she was like, I gotta pee, I gotta pee, and she started to drizzle, like, because we had to run from one side of the fair all the way to the bathroom. So, you know, those are go-outs training pants okay um also last but not least i got these cute little ghost uh marshmallows i want to pop a couple in alan's lunchbox and i told y'all last vlog that i want to do like a cute after school charcuterie board charcuterie board for the kids um so not sure if that's gonna be a today thing tomorrow's friday I do it Friday. I do it tomorrow. So they'll have something to uh look forward to, you know, since it's the freaking weekend and Alan has football practice today and Thursdays is homework night. So yeah, that ain't gonna work for us. So yeah, that's it for the haul, y'all. I have clothes that I have to start sorting here. Once I sort those clothes and stick a load in the washer, then I'm going to go back in our room and I'm going to start dusting our nightstands well y'all know we use like the mini bookshelves from target as our nightstand um and my purse bookshelf and my jewelry slash accessory bookshelf all that stuff needs to be um dusted very very badly so through talking y'all head off let me organize some stuff and i'll be back when i'm actually in the room It smells so good in here. I got some key sweat in the background. Now I have to fold all these clothes. So let's go. Okay, so I am out the house. I just put on a little makeup. I just did my brows, some light foundation, and put on some um, bronzer. 
and I am headed to the nail shop now. After I leave the nail shop, I am going to go to Slim Chickens. I have not been to Slim Chickens in so long. And in order to still keep it healthy <laughs> and uh, not do too much, I'm gonna get, I usually do like a fried chicken uh, buffalo wrap. So today I'm gonna do a grilled buffalo chicken wrap with the side of mac and cheese. And I'm so excited, cause like I said, I ain't been there forever. I know it's been a, oh! It's been a solid two weeks. I have not been to Slim's. And you know, that was our... It still is our place, but... Yeah, y'all know we go there all the time. But we haven't been there in a couple weeks. But the nail shop looks... Oh, the nail shop is empty. Babe, let me run on in here. Look at God. It's literally two minutes from my apartment. But okay, I'll see y'all when I get in. Yeah, I'm thấy mà em đi về Việt Nam mà nó qua nó 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 nói về vợ em giống như nó là người thân của vợ em vậy đó để em thấy không? Okay y'all, we are done. Um, I ended up just doing like black nails because I wanted an olive green, but they did not have they did not have the olive green like I wanted. They had the color last time I went in, but all of a sudden I couldn't find it today. So bummer. Um. I just was like, since we're taking family pictures, I just go with black. I mean, it is spooky season. Might as well black it up. As long as I had some on my hands. He was like, you bite your nail. And I was like, yes, I do. He was like, stop that. And I'm like, bro, okay, I'm gonna try. That's why I had to get some nails on because I was gonna keep biting them joints. But it is 12.30 now. Um, I'm trying to see if I really want to go to Slim's. I know I told y'all I was going to go to Slim's, but as I was sitting in that chair, I was like, I really would love a Olive Garden salad. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think I want Olive Garden. Yeah. Do I want to go to Olive Garden? Yeah, I think I'm going to go to Olive Garden so I can um, get a salad from there and some soup. So, yeah. We're going to go to Olive Garden. Do I want to go to Olive Garden or do I want to go to Slim's? Jasmine, make up your mind because you got to turn like now. Because I see I got to go to Walmart and I don't want to take Eddie with me. Okay. Let's just go to uh, Olive Garden. Because I got to go to Walmart afterwards to get some cream cheese. Because I got cheesecake jars to make later on today. And I got cheesecake shooters to make tomorrow. Um, and with all the craziness going on, like kidnapping people and all the kind of stuff and shootings and all that mess, I don't take the kids in the grocery store if I don't have to, especially by myself. Do not take them in the store with me by myself. So, Walmart is beside Olive Garden, so I might as well just do all that at once. So, yeah, okay, cool. I'm going to Olive Garden, give me a salad. I'll see y'all. Probably, probably when I get back home. Ah, probably when I get back home. Yeah, I'm gonna see y'all when I get back home after I pick the kids. Y'all, I just pulled up to Olive Garden and some kids are here on a field trip. Oh my God, it's probably like packed house in here because they literally have a charter bus. So, <laughs> let me go and see how long the wait is. Olive Garden parking lot is never this packed. That's why I like coming here because it's low key. But today ain't low key, baby. Today ain't low key at all. So let's, let's go see. Hey guys, I am home. Me and Eddie are on the couch. <laughs> My couch is peeling on me because I got this black shirt. I don't see I can see it good. If you are new here, we need a new couch. We don't want to get rid of it because we love it. Our sectional, we absolutely love it. Good. And we like the table. And we like the table. Okay. Anyway, we like this section. It's very comfortable and it has two like little let outs and all that kind of stuff. But it is starting to peel really bad. So if you ever see me sitting here, ignore the peeling couch. But anyway, I am now sitting on a couch because I need a nap. I need a little piece of a nap. Alan is supposed to do his homework, but he over here playing with toys that they made today in class and he's about to get took. Take it. Okay, it was made in STEM. 
It was made at school, basically. Look Smart mouth. Anyway, I'm about to take a nap. Um, after Alan get finished on his homework. Okay. What do they want to see? Oh, she fell, so she want to show you her legs. Do y'all see it? It's But anyway, yeah, we finna get her and take us a little nap. Okay, that she's showing y'all the other leg too. I don't know where. It's the knee this time, y'all see? Okay, they saw it. They said, oh. Anyway, taking a nap. When I get finished taking a nap, I'm gonna get up and start dinner. Very simple, some um, air fried chicken and some spaghetti. So I will see y'all when I get ready to start actually cooking dinner. Much later, cause it's not even 2.30 yet, so. I'll see y'all then. Y'all, let me tell y'all why I be sick of me, okay? I be sick of myself. I'm supposed to be cooking spaghetti and air fryer some chicken. The chicken is in the air fryer. Guess who ain't got no spaghetti noodles? Me. Only thing I got is angel hair. So we're gonna have to make it do what it do, because guess who ain't going to the store? Me. I'm sick of me. Thank you. Yes, Thank you too. Hey, everybody. Happy Friday. I just dropped the kids off. Okay, I'm trying to look my window up. I just dropped the kids off. And I am just now leaving Starbucks. I got me a refresher. I decided to treat myself today. Um, I haven't had a refresher all week, so... I was like, let me do a little something for me today. Today, um, I think I'm going to dye my hair. I know I talked to y'all about that yesterday. Um, I'm about to go by the beauty supply store and see if they are opened. I'm not sure if they are actually open, but I'm going to try. Oh, my God. That sun is terrible, y'all. Um, I'm going to try to see if they are open. Oh, I hate talking to y'all like this with the sun. But uh, I'm about to run by there. Now, if they're not opened, then I'm not going to worry about it right now. I'm probably going to come back out around lunch time. Or I'm going to see when they open and try to be like the first one there. Because I really want to get do my hair and just kind of get it over with. Um, I'm supposed to get a retwist later on. So, in order for me to my retwist to re look really good, I want to go ahead and dye my hair. So, yeah. That's the plan. I need to go home and sweep and mop. I have two more loads of clothes that I have to wash from yesterday that I separated. And nothing else. I told y'all I had some cheesecake shooters to do. I finished those last night um, before I got to bed. So her orders are to be picked up whenever she comes. I'm supposed to bake cookies today. I just thought about that. So, sweet mop cookies, hair dye, not really a lot going on. So, I'm about to drive into this parking lot now. I just posted it. I'm uh, throwing a pop-up shop on my Facebook page. And hopefully, I get a... Oh, they don't look like they're... Oh, no, nobody's here. I wonder what time do they open. Um, hopefully, I get a lot of people to want to be a part of the pop-up shop going to be November 12th. So if you are in the greater Memphis or North Mississippi area. Oh, they open at 9. They open at 9. Hmm. They open at 9. It's literally 30 minutes, but I'm not going to wait 30 minutes here because I'm about 3 minutes away from this uh, beauty supply store. But anyway, yeah, so if you are in the greater Memphis or North Mississippi area and you want to showcase in my pop-up shop, feel free. But anyway, heading home, sweet mob. Next time y'all see me, I will be back at the beauty supply store. They open in 30 minutes, so I'm about to go home. And I found Lincoln Park back in front of my freaking building because they're done paving the parking lot. So I don't feel like I have to walk a mile to get from the car back to the car to get back to my apartment, so perfect so yeah when i get back in there i will see y'all to pick out my dog y'all know i told y'all the other day that i absolute hate cooking because the smell lingers 
So y'all know I ended up picking the spaghetti last night. I found some angel hair noodles in the cabinet, so I used those last night. And I air fried some chicken. And when I tell y'all it smell like straight onion in here, I can't. I hate it. And now I'm trying to get the smell out of here. So I just lit some candles and my Pampas candle is running low. Um, I ended up buying the, wait a minute, it's the salt candle. So I bought that one um, a couple weeks ago, whatever, but that one's burning. But my Pampas one that's sitting over here, it's almost dead. So I have to go and try and um, find some more candles or whatever. But let me just say this. I always heard Chelsea Janae talking about this. Um, I think it's coconut and honey. Y'all, just listen. I'm obsessed and it smells so good. So, that's my new baby. <laughs> I have not given up on my Pampers candle, but that coconut and honey candle smells delicioso. So, I'm probably running by Target. Um... Maybe I'll run by Target before I get the kids or after I get the kids so I can get a couple more of those um, wood wick candles. I love hearing that sound. And they smell so yummy. So, I just had to pop in and tell y'all that. So, let me go ahead and mop like I said I have to do. And I'm about to wipe down countertops because it just smells like onion. I can't deal. can't deal with this smell. When I left the... Beauty supply store. I randomly decided to go get my oil change. And guess who's with me? Gracie girl. My mom and daddy are in Vegas for my mama 50th birthday. 50th birthday. And today is her actual birthday. So we're here getting a little oil change. And yeah, we'll be home soon so I can dye this hair. Okay, y'all. I am home. I'm getting my oil change. Let me tell y'all something. Adulting, baby. <laughs> Adulting don't ever get no good. Oil change. $80. Beauty supply store. $40. Gas in my truck. $40. Baby. When is it going to get better? Okay, but from the beauty supply store, quick haul. We needed another brush. Um, my black mamas know these good old brushes here. Just to brush back the baby's hair. Not too hard. This is a medium brush. I don't like the the, the brushes that are um, like extremely hard. Let's slick them ponytails back. We got to do what we got to do. Finally found Addie a little bunnet. I have been looking for her little bunny for so long because it's time for homegirl to start sleeping, start sleeping with a bunny on her head and I'm going to put it behind the door where I put my eyes um, And I got me a new bonnet. I got it because it was cheap, right? And look, y'all can see, I haven't even, I haven't even did that rack like I told y'all. I was supposed to do it. Oh, this one is huge. Oh, God. This must be like a weave or something. Anyway, me and Eddie got some new bonnets. I got some processing caps because I needed that for this stuff. Peppermint oil, a spray bottle because Gracie, Gracie, where are we at? Anyway, spray bottle because ours be getting clogged up the one we got now. I don't like that, so I'm not so close that one way. And I went ahead and I did get the semi-permanent because I keep hearing if you dye your locks too much, they'll thin out. And I don't want mine to be thin. I won't be walking around here looking like Stevie. <laughs> okay. Um, I changed shirts into something dark, so I had that white shirt on. I didn't want to. $40, y'all. $40. I thought I was playing. I don't know it. I don't know it. $34, $40. 40. Um, let me see. 
So yeah. Let's read the instructions. Shampoo in towel. Oh, I'm gonna go shampoo my hair. I'll be back. Okay, so hair is washed. Now let's proceed. Shampoo and dry well. Use protection cream around hairline. Apply. She wish I would have went exact. I still turn to a CEO, so the lifestyle she respect. Hey, two sprinters to Quebec. Chucky, who am on back? They only giving niggas plus one, so I never pull up to the Met. You know I gotta bring the set. You know I gotta bring the G block. You know I gotta bring the D block, cause you know how sticky it get. Hey. 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 She want me to play with that cat. Hey. She love how I'm making her wet. You know how sticky it get, ayy hey. yo, Eric, bring them girls to the stage Cause somebody's getting paid And free big slime out the cage And shorty try to play it cool But now she wish she would've stayed Cause every song that I made Is ringing like I got engaged I Love my guys, I wouldn't trade ay. Run the cradle to the grave Gordo got me on a wave And got me on a wave Couple of hits, now you're brave Wait, You niggas better behave but All that pumping up your chest but All that talk about the best you know how sticky it gets. Yeah. If I'm with two of them, then it's a threesome. If she alone, you know she a freak one. If it's an escort, it's a police one. King of the hill, you know it's a steep one. If we together, you know it's a brief one. Back in the ocean, you know it's a, it's a deep one. Forgave niggas and they feelings Lucky for y'all, we don't do civilians You say I changed, I say that I'm millions I did The toughest act follows back on tour Off-road, made back, Pyrex, Trap, Virgil came back through the boy Damn That's something to me, niggas really had they back turned to me I ain't talking my system when I say niggas down to pack something for me Then they thought they had a trap set for me How you really think that went for me? Niggas gotta do a fact check for me When everything is put through and everybody takes a and everything gets a trip.